So basically, something happened um, yesterday. My friend and I had a little misunderstanding slash argument, and he literally ditched me in the middle of the trip, and he drove back to Taipei. Good morning, guys. It's Monday morning and we are finally on the road for our road trip. Uh, we were supposed to meet at 7 a.m. this morning with my friend Steve, but we couldn't make it because it was a little bit early. So we met at 10 a.m. and we went to Starbucks to get our coffee. And Steve wanted an Americano and I wanted a latte. But since I'm a really good friend, we got Americano. And it is actually really disgusting. No, I don't like black coffee. You don't like hot coffee. Okay, I don't like hot coffee. I it's, just... like, it's like French people saying uh, uh, champagne is like wine. No, but... It's, it's fucking not. No, but I do enjoy drinking like sweet coffee. Anyway. So now we are on our way to Senmu Lake. It's three hours and a half drive from Taipei to Senmu Lake. I hope we can make it for lunch because I am hungry now. <laughs> okay, so it's gonna take six minutes. Um, so we decided to take the boat first instead of biking because the weather is not really nice for the moment. And it was actually really cheap. It was 50 koi per person, which is like 1 euro 30. So yeah, we're just gonna enjoy the view first and then bike, bike, bike. Welcome to Sun Lake. Ah! <laughs> I'm recording, you know, right? I know. I feel a bit tired now. I feel like I need a coffee. There's nothing to do here. Let's We're going go. to the second stop, which is. What is it? What is the second stop? You don't know! <laughs> Alright, so I am doing kayaking by myself because Steve didn't want to come with me. And this is exhausting, guys. <laughs> I've been like doing this for like 45 minutes and I can't feel my arms anymore. But yeah, I need to go back there. <laughs> Subscribe to my channel and give a thumbs up! Good morning guys! So this is day 2 of our road trip in Taiwan and we are currently in Jiayi so today's plan is to visit the art museum and apparently it's the best in Taiwan so we have to go there and after that, it's gonna be quite chill because there's no much to do here. And we will drive to Kanting end of the afternoon. So it takes about three hours and a half. And I really can't wait to go there because I really want to go to the beach and get some sun. The weather is super nice in Kanting. It's like 28 degrees in February. Can you imagine that? So yeah, we will go there and get some sun. Oh, <laughs> it smells so good. It smells like summer. Do you want some? All right, so we arrive at the art museum of Jai, and I really need to calm down because I had my coffee and I had eight hours of sleep, so I'm super high on energy right now. <laughs> oh my god, I hate myself. But yeah, let's go.
to meet my auntie. Oh my god. <laughs> I can't sleep and it's currently 4.30 a.m. The reason why I can't sleep is because my friend is snoring. I swear it shouldn't be allowed to snore that loud. Oh, there's a car. <laughs> um, I'm so fucked up because we have so many things to do tomorrow morning and Right now it's either I go to sleep and I get like 3 hours of sleep Either I wait for the sunrise which is at 6.30 So I don't know <laughs> Gosh, those cars are driving really fast And it's so windy and I have no money and no mask <laughs> Gosh Good morning guys, this is day three of our road trip in Taiwan. Surprisingly, I am actually in a pretty good mood, even though I said three hours. Oh my god, my voice. <laughs> but yeah, uh, this morning we are going to calling. I am so happy. guys this is day four of the road trip in Taiwan I haven't vlogged a lot yesterday and this morning because I'm still trying to process this whole thing so basically something happened um, yesterday my friend and I had a little misunderstanding slash argument and he literally ditched me in the middle of the trip and he drove back to Taipei so I'm not blaming him because I think he's going through a hard time in his life but I am generally blaming myself because I chose to say yes to this trip even though I didn't really know him I guess that's a life lesson I mean I'm young, I'm 23 and I'm still learning a lot of things in life and that's also what I love about traveling is that you are going through some unpredicted moments and problems that you have to deal with and uh, I'm gonna bounce back guys <laughs> I just need some time to process all this stuff but this afternoon I'm going for a surfing lesson and I'm gonna have fun I also have some friends who happen to be in Kenting so I'm gonna have dinner with them tonight um, I just need to um, schedule the rest of the road trip. I'm not sure if I will go to Kaohsiung, but I decided to stay for another night here. And I really want to um, take this chance to travel a little bit by myself, because that's something I've always wanted to do. So yeah, stay positive and we will get through that. Keep watching, guys. <laughs> guys I just finished the surfing lesson I am exhausted <laughs> it was so much fun though I'm gonna join my friends to grab dinner and 
I'm actually really happy that I did that. Self motivation, guys. Santé, santé, santé. Good morning, guys. This is day five of the road trip in Taiwan, and it's getting more and more spontaneous. <laughs> so basically, I had dinner with my friends yesterday, and one of them is doing the scuba diving open license, and he kind of convinced me to do it as well. So I am doing it right now. I can't believe it. Uh, basically, it's a three days license, and the cost is 15,000 kwai, so it's about 450 euros. It's actually not that expensive compared to other countries in Europe, but I feel like once you have it, you have it forever. It's like the driving license, and you can dive everywhere in the world. So I feel like it's so, so insane. And today's lesson is at the swimming pool, and it's all about getting familiar with the equipment. So I hope I won't die, <laughs> but I feel like it's gonna be fine. I know how to swim, so I think I will be fine. Good morning guys, this is day 6 of the road trip in Taiwan and this morning I'm so excited because we are going to dive in the ocean and I think I'm ready. <laughs> I took a pill though this morning because I have motion sickness but I hope I won't puke. <laughs> I am really really excited because we are going to dive with turtles and this is like heaven. <laughs> I'm so excited guys. So many guys. Are you ready? Let's go! Let's go! Good morning, guys! This is the last day in Kanting and the last day before getting the scuba diving license. I'm a good student, right? Yeah. I'm the best! The best of what? The best students! an open water diver which sounds really cool <laughs> honestly like i really recommend you to do it if you are um, a fan of water activities or if you want to discover more about the ocean or if you just want to challenge yourself go for it like it takes three days and basically you have to go through um, all the basic vocabulary knowledge of scuba diving then you will have to go to the swimming pool to learn scuba diving skills and then you will have to dive four times uh, in the ocean or in a lake. And that's it. And then you can be part of the diving family. That's super awesome. I'm gonna call my dad and mom to tell them that 
I am a diaper. That's so spontaneous, though.